hopefully you say nothing at all. When you get a DUI in San Francisco County um, or any county or city in the San Francisco Bay Area, uh, you want to hire a lawyer. You want to get the best lawyer you can so that person can say everything for you in court. And in most DUI cases, appear for you every step of the way. So hopefully you never have to go to court. Every once in a while, we need a client in court. And if you are going to need to say anything in front of the judge or to the judge, we prep you for that. A good lawyer will always try and keep their clients out of court if they don't need to be there and just let them know what's going on. If they need to be there, what's going to be expected and kind of walk them through what is going to happen. Um, the, the, this question is usually asked right after someone gets a DUI and they're thinking, I need to go to court. I need to say something to the judge. And they wonder, should I, you know, just fall on, on the mercy of the court? Should I just apologize profusely? What, or should I, you know, say nothing at all? Or what do I do? Well, it's, it's something where you talk to the lawyer and the lawyer walks you through what they're going to do at court. And then they take care of everything. So what the lawyer is basically going to do with the first court appearance is typically enter a plea of not guilty, um, waive time. You have a constitutional right to a jury trial, to a speedy trial, and we waive that right because you're not in custody in most cases in a DUI, um, unless it's a more serious felony type DUI, then you might be in custody. But most cases are first or second DUIs, and we spend the you know the time after the first court appearance to the next court appearance gathering evidence to defend the case to do our investigation um the lawyer is you know going back to what the lawyer says they set a new court date basically uh they let the prosecutor's office the da's office in san francisco or whatever county your dui case is in you know know that they are um making sure that they have our contact information they don't contact you but they'll contact us with the discovery, with the reports, complaints, um, records that we request, breath testing records, blood testing records, records on the machines that were used, the chromatograms um, for blood testing. We want to see video, whether it's body cam video on the officer or dash cam video on their squad cars, um, video of a blood draw, if that exists. And uh, there's a lot of other things that we look into to determine whether or not um, we can make your case go away. Uh, and if we can't do that, we're doing our investigation to determine um, what the best result we can get for you. And eventually, you get to make the decision if we cannot make the case go away, whether you want to take the best deal that your lawyer can negotiate for you. Or if you want to go to a jury trial, everyone has a right to a, a jury trial in California on a misdemeanor DUI. And um, while most of the cases do not go to jury trial, sometimes it still does happen. And that's your right. Um, and yet, going back to this original question, you may, even at a jury trial, never make any statement because you, you're not required to testify. And typically, it's better not to have a client testify unless we really need them to. Um, and if you do need to testify at a jury trial, then a good lawyer is really going to prepare you and spend a lot of time doing that. Anyway, um, that's kind of what you need to know about what needs to be said in court. And the bottom line is let the attorney do all the talking. And if you ever get a call from a cop or an investigator from the prosecution or anyone Regarding this case, after you've been arrested, after, you know, you've gone to jail or been cited out or whatever, and they need follow-up information, your response needs to be, this is my lawyer, they'll get back to you, or here's their contact information. You should never talk to someone other than your lawyer about your case after you've been arrested for a DUI.